Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing out some toka hacks and I think this is going to be really fun because I never really tested out toka hacks before. Um, but yeah, today I'm going to be testing them out. Um, let's hope they all turn out good. But yeah, let's get started. Um, I'm just going to go get on my phone and let's watch some toka hacks, I guess. So this is the first one, it's basically kind of like a bouncy bed. Let's try it. Okay guys, so now we're just gonna go and try it. This one is actually pretty simple, but it's really cute and I can't wait. So we're just gonna go get a bed now since we've got the trampoline already. Should be all the way down here. Uh, um, and here. And we're also gonna hide the trampoline a bit up. Like that's as much as we can do it. But now we're gonna go and oh, okay. Um, wait. I'm gonna put my person on the trampoline, and then I'm gonna put her in the middle, and then we're gonna put the bed over. That should be better. Oh my gosh, it's actually super cute. It looks like she's jumping on the bed, which was the whole um idea of it. But it's so cute. Isn't that so cute? I love this hack. It's so adorable. Anyways, moving on, we're gonna go to the next hack. So yeah. Okay, so now we're just going to go and test out the hack. I think it's super cool. I did test it out a long time ago, but that was a long time ago. So now we're going to test it out again. So I think we use the clear laptop computer, um, which should be over here. Also going to need a desk for this because, um, yeah, we need to use this new purple desk. And now we're just going to go and get the TV complete it um where is it here okay i'm gonna try put it right there wait i think you need to switch it on before you do it and then. oh my gosh that is so cute and it looks so aesthetic wow oh but you can't really change the channel if you press on it oh my gosh i actually am obsessed with this hack um, and I'll probably try to use it in my house if I have any laptops or stuff. But yeah. So for this next hack, you basically have to put, um, paintings in a pool and they should change. Uh, I don't really know if this is fake, but let's try it. Okay, so we're actually at the haunted house and we're going to collect some of the paintings. So, um, one is in here and I think the others are downstairs and over here. We have this one and this one. Is it, did it go in the box? Okay, now I'm gonna go downstairs because I think some of them are downstairs. But yeah. Um, so I'm not sure if they're all downstairs. I know this one is there, and I don't know where the last one is. Is it in here? Wait, no. No not really sure where to find it uh um i don't really know if i can find the last one so we're just gonna go try this hack without the last one and um, yeah it doesn't really matter okay so we're at the pool and we're gonna go and test some of these so let's see if it actually worked i'll be surprised if they actually worked but um let's go ahead and see Oh my god, it actually worked. I didn't think it was going to work. I literally thought it was not going to work. Let's try this one. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. They actually change. Let's see this one. Okay, so this one kind of like gets an eye on it. This one, eyes go like dribbly and its mouth goes dribbly too. These three people, they go like... <gasps> And then this little um, picture, it just looks like some trees and mountain. But it's actually like a big something behind it. I don't know what that is. And then we have this one. This one. I actually didn't think this was going to happen. But it actually did happen. So yeah, let's go on to the next hack and we'll see if it actually works. Okay, so moving on to the next hack. This is like stacking washing machines, which I think is super cool and I can't wait to try this out. So yeah, let's go try it. 
Okay, so here we are at my Togger house, um, and we're gonna test out this hack. Obviously, I'm not gonna keep it that way, if even like if it looks good, because I just want to keep the um, way I made this house. But we're just gonna take all these items off first, um, and yeah. Okay, guys, so I kind of like just moved everything up. Now I'm gonna go and try the hack. So I think you kind of like put the um, thingy right halfway over on top here and then she went and got the um what do you call it a washing machine uh oh what did i do um and she got the washing machine and she kind of put it like this and then oh it stays for a second and i've tried this hack before and it worked she's gonna go and try this again i think i let go too early this kind of takes time sometimes Wait, what, it just disappeared? Wait, let me try that again. What? Uh, why is it not working? Basically, you get the gist of it. You basically just do this until it works. Okay, let's try this again. Oh my gosh, guys, it actually stayed. Well, it didn't actually go on top, which um, is not really how I wanted to turn it out. Because the other times I do it, it goes like directly on top. But at least it went on, I think. Can we put these on top? No. But um, it is pretty cute. I'm going to try it so that it goes on top, though, just because... What? Okay, so it's not going on top, but um, this is how it looks like. I think it's really pretty cute, um, but I'm not going to keep it this way. Just because I like the um, design of the washing machine not stacked. But maybe in a different house, um, this would look cute. But yeah, I prefer my old way. So this next hack is like kind of like a money tree. I think it's super cute and we're going to try that out. We're also going to try like this cupcake hack. I didn't know about it until now and I think it's so adorable. Okay, so we're actually going to um, try out the money tree thingy. Um, we're just going to go to plants and find a plant. Um, and yeah, so we're going to use this plant. And now we have to go to the toilet roll. We need, we're going to get the modern mansion one. And now we look, there's a money tree. And also this is actually really helpful for like if you um, don't know where to keep money in Toka. Then you can just use this for like spare. I think it's really cute and easy to use. Because it just looks like it's falling from the tree. Which is so cute and so adorable okay so now we're basically gonna try the cupcake hack so um i think they got like kind of like um where is it um they got like they're like this cake the log cake and then they got like a burger bun which should be down here where is it here and we're going to like connect them and then we also got some like i got some cream from like um the mall and we're just gonna put it on top oh my gosh it actually looks like a real cupcake and i think that's super adorable let's go taste it that was so cute and so delicious uh anyways let's move on to the next hack um yeah Okay, so for this next hack, it's like really strange, but you basically put the baby in a chocolate fountain and then you can wash it off. I've never tried this hack before and uh, I think it's really weird, but um, let's go try it. Okay, guys, so we're currently at the chocolate fountain and we're just going to go and dip this baby in. Honestly, Toka is really weird with babies. Like, you can do anything with babies in Toka. Like, you can wrap them up. It's just really strange. But now we're going to go and wash her and see if this hack actually works. So, I've basically got the baby and I think we're going to turn the tap on and we're going to put her in the bath. Okay, so I think you have to get the products or did it work? No. So the products the person used was basically like um, a sponge, which I think we can use. This one, and what was it? That was like she used this and this. And um, she also used... 
this. So yeah, we're just gonna go and scrub first. Oh, it all actually went off. That was pretty easy. Um, so we don't actually need to use all of these products that the person in the video used. You actually just need to scrub them and yeah, it worked. But that was actually really strange and funny at the same time. But yeah, let's go to the next hack. <laughs> So the next hack is actually free, so anyone can really do it. Um, basically, it's kind of like a counter, and you don't need any game passes for this, and you can basically just decorate it. And I think it's really helpful for people who don't have any game passes, and yeah. So I kind of like already did it, so now I'm gonna like um, kind of decorate it, just so you can get like an idea of how it would kind of look like if it was like um, a real kitchen, like, you know. So we're going to add some shelves right over here. I'm going to add one over here and over like here. I'm going to add some more shelves. Um, you can have it, never have enough shelves. Oh, I also forgot to add a fridge actually. So I'm just going to go ahead and add that too. So we're going to add that right here. And then I think we're going to add more shelves. Um, yeah. Uh, so I think we're just gonna add like um, a little hook over here so you can uh, hang up some towels. Um, and we're gonna go put a shelf over here. I might add a TV so like you can watch TV. I don't really know, it's just like to fill space. And I think like the TV kind of makes it look really cozy, I don't know. But we're just going to go and add it right over here. Cute. And now we're going to go ahead and start decorating. I got this bag of free stuff. Um, we're going to just uh, go ahead and start like decorating it. Uh, I'm not really good at decorating with free stuff. But why is this TV starting off? So yeah. Okay, so this is a final result. I mean, it's not that bad, like, for a free house, but, yeah. Um, you can decorate this um, any way you like to, though. This was just, like, an idea if you wanted, like, to do it. Uh, yeah. So, the next hack is actually how to make um, a push chair because Toga actually doesn't have push chairs, so you have to make one for yourself if you want a push chair. But um, people have actually come up with some really cute ideas. So, this is the first idea. There are actually two, um, but this one is very modern. Um, I'm going to show you the second one in a minute. I've tried this hack before and it's really cute. Um, but here's the second one. Um, you actually get this trolley from the train station. And I think it's a bit more simpler. But we're going to try both of them just to see how, um, what one is better. Anyways, let's get into this. Okay, so first we're going to try, um, the first one. Um, I have tried this one before, but that was a long time ago. And I did put it in okay, one so of my videos. But, um, yeah. Um, I think it's in tables. We just need to get, like, that little trolley kind of. Thingy. I'm using the brown one, so it's kind of like a push chair shape. Um, it's cute, I guess. And then we're gonna get the little box with the ribbon. I think it's in the post office. I don't know. Oh no, it's in beds. I'm so silly. Okay, here it is. But you want to get um, basically, you want it to turn into a present. So we're gonna need another table, but this is a gift wrapping table. Oh, mm. uh, could you use this one? You could use this one. Um, that's pretty weird because this is what you use to wrap up coffee. But anyways, we're just going to... I like it this way. So we're just going to go and put this on. We're not going to use the umbrella, but um, you can if you want to. Oh, yeah. I'm going to um, put a little box at the bottom. Actually, I don't need a box. We're just going to go and put some milk bottles. Um, 
like, where is it? Uh, we could use, uh, where's milk? Okay, we'll use this and this. And we'll probably just get a toy, uh, like, uh, I'm, I'm really indecisive, so sorry for this, but, um, we're just gonna go get, like, a little fluffy toy, or maybe a rattle, so this. And now we're gonna open this, and it should be into, like, a pushchair kind of shape. Now we're gonna go get a little child. I don't think you can, like, use these type of children for this hack. Um, you have to use the babies in the hospital. So I'm just going to go and get a baby, and I'll be right back. Okay, so we have this baby from earlier, and we're just going to go put her here. She can't go the other way? Okay, never mind. But it's actually really cute. You can even hold it. I think this hack is so adorable. Um, since And it's so creative since Toka actually hasn't gave you um, push chairs. Oh yeah, and if you take this off, you can't put it back on again unless you wrap it. But anyways, that was that. I'm also going to try the other push chair hack. So yeah, let's get into that so for the next push chair it's actually way more simpler than the first one you just need this trolley which is from the train station and then we're gonna go get a table to wrap the bed in once again uh we'll just use this one and um, we're gonna go and get the bed um which is from the festive pack and now we're just gonna go and put it right on there I want it to go this way. Yeah. Okay. Now I'm going to chuck this in the bin. And we're going to open it. And there. It actually looks like a push chair too. I don't know if I prefer this um, way and the other way. Obviously, this one, the baby can't really um, go on the bed since... Wait, I've got an idea. So, basically, we're going to keep this thing. But we're going to go and get the wrapping pin. And... We're going to put the baby on top of it because before the baby was just sitting on here. But if the baby sits on here, then we wrap it. Then you put it on the pistia. There, that was way more easier. And you have your pistia. I think these hacks are so cute, the pistia ones. But yeah. So for the last talker hack, we're actually doing a baby one. And it's just showing how to close our eyes. Um, and yeah, let's do it. Okay, so we're currently at the mall. And I think she basically just turned it on and then put the baby on it. Oh my gosh, it actually worked. And the baby's eyes are closed. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh, but if you take it out of your hands, it just wakes up. But it's actually so cute though. Oh, that's so cute. You can do a little photo shoot of the baby sleeping. Or if you want to make a talker video of your baby sleeping, then you can do it. That is actually so adorable though. And yeah, I think we'll leave it at that note. Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, that's all from me. Bye. Also, comment down below what was your favorite hack. Mine was definitely the baby in the chocolate fountain. But yeah, comment down below what one was yours. And yeah, that's all for me. Bye.